welcome to indian thoughts shining wings channel this is tuned to its slogan motivate guide and help all the episodes are short but contain classic thought provoking stories kindly visit our website for hundreds of such stories in text audio and video i am joseph episode 34 growing rich recently i happened to see a picture it was shot by one anil prabhakar the scene was an orangutan helping a renowned geologist to come out of a mud hole in the forest a picture might equate a thousand words when covid was at its zenith i had written that nature is after its most vicious enemy human being animals don't kill anything for pleasure even king cobra does not spare its poison unnecessarily no carnivorous animal on earth keep meat tried for another coming day man but kills animals not only to preserve but also for pleasure look at a tree and see into the purpose of it here anybody can make a nest on its branches no permission required anybody can eat its fruits use its shade no permissions are required it never complains even if children throw it from all angles looking for a wet touch its roots go deeper and deeper and that never complaining it gives shade to people and it shields everyone from scorching heat and smashing lightnings it has given us the freedom to cut it by branches or stump itself a tree is there just for others it has no four or front categories in its relationships maybe the woodpecker is best friend just as a poet sang holding the blue sky on its top lives holy trees when it comes to animal life like plants no animal may visibly offer themselves for others knowing that every land needs some animal for food no animal comes forward the rules are different there a land has to run run and run and outrun no preferences to lions for the reason that they are kings it's not true to say that all animals live in the present many have thoughts of tomorrow have you seen ants and bees storing for tomorrow at the other end of evolution comes man with a double consciousness here only a few realized live in the present most others live either in tomorrows or in yesterdays group life for humans is not just for self existence but for my demonstrations too the rule of forgiveness and reconciliation is strange to humans unlike in plant kingdom or animal world human pleasure is attacking nature from all angles it happens in politics in religion in cultures of distinct colors everywhere man has set goals set in the horizon he is not trying to settle down with all the abundance he has been given here the story of a greedy farmer he requested the emperor for more land to cultivate the emperor told him to take into custody that much land up to which point he can run one day the farmer was happy he ran as fast as he could but only to fall down dead we don't know if future of past are real we keep plundering storing as much as we can even if one has already earned enough for a thousand generations he or she continues to run no. nobody ever stops to relax gandhi ji once took a cup of water only from a big river he said that it was just what he was supposed to take taking more than one deserves is aparigraha or stealing according to the teachings but who actually are rich or poor truly even a man going to bed without a dinner need not be poor it is decided by the fight where he is in shortage or plenty if one limits itself to needs and could find an excess somewhere he should be rich because he has with him something to share thank you all for patiently watching this meet you again